the most painful ways to die, according to science. We are all mortal, and there is nothing we can do about it, other than hope to live a long, happy life. Of course, if we pass away in a peaceful, pain-free way, that is very much welcome. But unfortunately, this is not the case for everyone. In fact, there are indeed very painful ways to die. In this gallery, we delve into what science has to say about it. Chlorine trifluoride, CLF3. Chlorine trifluoride was first discovered in the 1930s. It is a very reactive liquid that pretty much burns everything it comes into contact with. Exposure to chlorine trifluoride would be horrific. Scientist Paul Doherty explains. The chlorine will turn your bones to gelatin. Your fingers will turn from rods into little rounded stubs. Decompression sickness. When divers go into deep waters, they breathe compressed air that is much richer in oxygen and nitrogen than the one they would breathe on the surface. The nitrogen accumulates, and if divers return to the surface too quickly, it will expand and form bubbles, affecting the entire body. Decompression sickness, also known as barotrauma or the bends, can be very painful and lead to death. Boomslang. The boomslang is a highly venomous snake. A bite from this snake causes severe internal bleeding, uncontrollable shaking, nausea, and high fever. The venom essentially leads to hemorrhages, making it a very painful way to die. Pancreatic cancer. From nerve pain to bone damage and treatment side effects, dying from cancer can be extremely painful, with pancreatic cancer being one of the worst. It causes agonizing abdominal and back pain, intestinal blockages, and referred soft tissue pain in other parts of the body. Radiation. Acute radiation syndrome, ARS, from high doses of radiation damages tissue and genetic material, leading to severe health problems that impact the immune system. Complications like the collapse of the circulatory system eventually result in death. Heart attack. Heart attacks often come with warning signs that are very painful. Symptoms include pain radiating to the arm, jaw, neck, and back along with a crushing pressure on the chest described as feeling like an elephant sitting on your chest. Freezing. Hypothermia, caused by freezing temperatures, leads to uncontrollable shivering, muscle stiffness, and brain malfunction. Blood is redirected to vital organs, causing pain in the extremities and frostbite, which feels like burning. Burning. Burning to death is absolutely horrific due to the numerous nerves in the skin. The pain from burning, inhaling smoke, and hot air is agonizing. Exposure to lava would cause the skin to boil and instant rigor mortis, potentially boiling the brain and cracking the skull. Electrocution. Dying by electrocution is incredibly painful. A powerful enough electric charge causes muscles to seize, bones to break, skin to swell, and even eyeballs to pop out of their sockets. The whole process is excruciating. Drowning. Drowning can be quite painful. Panic leads to hyperventilation, but instead of air, water is inhaled, causing a vocal cord spasm known as laryngospasm. Breathing in water causes extreme pain, and even survivors experience lung pain for some time. Lethal injection. Lethal injection is supposed to be less painful compared to other methods, but it can still be excruciating. The drugs used may cause extreme pulmonary edema, and without anesthetics, the pain can last for minutes to hours. Crucifixion. Crucifixion, historically involving nails through the wrists hitting the median nerve, is excruciatingly painful. The word, excruciating, actually comes from, crucifixion. From chemical exposures and physical trauma to deadly diseases and suffocation, these methods highlight the varied and excruciating ways life can end. It serves as a reminder of our mortality and the value of living a safe, healthy life. If you loved this video, do not forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more science-based videos. Thanks for watching, and see you next time on Science Deli.